Spears and I'm here in New York City at Battery Studios and we are remixing the track of You Drive Me Crazy for the video. Baby, I'm so into you. You got that something. What can I do? The reason why we're doing a different remix for the video is because we want something with more punch. Thank you. Perfect. The track's all done, so I guess I'll see you in rehearsal. All right, guys, thanks a lot for coming. There's casting 20 dances, I believe, all together. All types, everybody comes in here with an equal playing field. Let's go and get started. Basically, you're gonna take your right hand, you're gonna push your head to the left, and your legs are just gonna come in, out, in, out. Body moving, body moving. He's the type of director, the reason why I love him so much is because he's, he, he really listens to my ideas and he's so easy to work with and he's smart and his results, you know, that come out in his videos are phenomenal. I've had a different life experience than Brittany has. It's great to know what's going on in her mind and be able to make a video for her that is in a situation which she feels right in. One, two, three, cuatro. Stay, stay, stay. The rest, thank you very much. Stay, you too. Stay. Everyone else, can you please leave? So first day of dance rehearsals, and Darren is in there teaching them the initial steps. And six, seven, and eight. So I can go in later and mess it all up. Darren's really good. His choreography fits me really well because he's really thrashy and he hits it. The concept of the video was all of my idea. I thought it'd be really cool if we were like in a club and we we're like dorky waitresses and then all of a sudden we break out and we just start dancing because the song is so strong and powerful. I'm stressing out because I have a tour and these rehearsals at the same time. But and we also have a performance on Saturday. We have a performance on Saturday as well. So we're a little crazy. But. But for me the big trick when I'm asking Brittany to do stuff is probably is to not make her do too much stuff because she would literally run herself into the ground. And three, and four. I don't really think of it as work, to be honest with you, because I love what I'm doing. I love singing and I love dancing. Oh my goodness. Brittany, she brings dance and performance to another level. Damn. Well, I've given Darren a sort of rough idea of what I'd like him to do, and then I leave him to it basically for a while because my choreographical skills are extremely limited. So I have very specific things, ideas of things I'd like to do. No, no, so, no, no, I, yeah, I, yeah. I mean, because I wrote the placements down. And of course, Darren, being the headstrong young man that he is, has his own ideas of what he'd like to do. So, so you're good. I mean, I just we're want them to learn the choreography yeah, first. Gonna... So the trick is to make sure that, you know, I can pull the two together and uh, come up with a fantastically artistic compromise. So at the start, the camera will be here. Then what I want to do, because visually speaking, this side isn't as interesting, right. is I then want to bring the axis round this way so that then halfway through the chorus, the camera comes halfway here. Halfway through. So that now when they turn round, the camera's yeah, round here, and then you see the whole set, got which would be, Done. you know, really interesting. Got it. Got it. All right? Got it. Whenever Nigel asks me to adjust something um, in terms of the dance steps for the video, what I do is uh, listen to what he says, and then I tell him whether or whether or not it'll actually work. What is going to happen now is you're going to change the direction in which the way you are dancing. In other words, the routine which we are doing this way will end up facing that way after six. So we do it the same, the girls are the same, or no? Sorry, yeah, the girls are the same. So in other words, you would go like, like this. A one and two and three and four, five, six and seven and eight. No, you're gonna face that way. Oh, we go, we go. Yeah. And then 
we're just limited for time, so I'm a little stressed out. But it's the you know the choreography is really good and it's wonderful. It's hard, but once we get it all together, it's going to be really big. It's, I, I hope it is. Thank you very much, guys. It looks great. On Saturday, you have a fitting. my options. It's very Barbarella. It's very sexy. Our waitress outfits. We didn't discuss this with Nigel, but when we're in the bathroom scene, you know, mm -hmm. when I'm trying on clothes, this can be an outfit I try on but doesn't look right because I just want to show it because it's so cute. Mm -hmm. And be like, oop, no. I'm like, oh, this doesn't work. Okay, yeah. let's try something and then else. I'm gonna try that on. Bye. Uh, all the dancers and Brittany have been working really, really hard on the video. We've been doing it for about four days now. Bust, 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 bust. I'm a singer who dances, definitely. I'm a performer as well. What we have to do is clean that one section up where you guys push back and ladies push yeah. forward. Very much for a great rehearsal, members for real on Monday. I didn't sleep very well last night, I never do. <laughs> I've not had a very good breakfast and um, sure I'm nervous. I just know I've got a whole day ahead of me. I'm trying to enjoy just sitting in this chair. I'm gonna be dancing all day. It'll probably be my biggest video as far as production goes. This is a safety meeting. First foremost, welcome to our shoot today from Band Apart, Britney Spears. Hard hats are required. Here's what's going to happen. Downstairs you have boys coming down one corridor, girls coming down another corridor, and then they're going to meet here before the first chorus, right? So suddenly, it's like, holy okay. moly. I nearly said This is just a rehearsal. <laughs> It doesn't build into any drama. It's just not uh, exciting. I'm gonna alter one step. What I want to see is this: one, two, three, and four. That way. Um, Nigel only changed one thing, and what we did was actually altered um, one of the four throughs on the first verse. Brittany's grace is professional, and she goes, you know, real easy with the changes and stuff. And you just think it through and make it happen. And two, a three, and four. Thank you, please. Because I've just got so much choreography on my head right now. Right. I would feel so much more comfortable if you just keep it the same. I mean, I would. The thing is, Nigel said he cannot get the shot with it like that. Usually when we're, when we're in rehearsal, they, we change things a lot. But usually when you get on the set, you don't really change the formation of things that much. One and two and three and four. Five. No. Nah, just go over to that. Get that. Just go straight into your five. One and two and three and four. <laughs> Try and get that. at first, but then I just had to work with it because I knew Nigel was right and I knew that he's only doing it for my best interest to make a good video, so I worked with it. Not bad, but we can do better. I mean, I don't, it's not, I'm not seeing so much of the big dance moves here now, right? A lot of so I just want to see this. Yeah, I want to know you're doing it. My first day of shooting this video was a little bit crazy for me because it was my first time to do the actual routine without a mirror in front of me, so I kind of had to get adjusted to that and just focusing on a camera. And the set is so exciting and so colorful and fun, so it made things a lot more fun for me.
tomorrow's going to be an interesting day because my my promise to Brittany and her manager was that they would be on a plane by 9.30 tomorrow night. So I have to make sure whatever happens that Brittany can walk at 9.29 tomorrow night. I can be saying bye bye Brittany and she and her dance is going to leave. for the tour at the same time. But I know everything's going to come together and everything's going to be fine, but just getting to that point is a little stressful. Forget it's 11 o'clock in the morning and you're dancing like crazy all day yesterday. I know you feel this, but I want to physically feel it. You, you know, it doesn't need to be anger, but it needs to be passion. Okay, okay. La passion. I've been on tour with the dancers, I think, for a year now. You just become like family because you work with them day and night. We just become really close. <laughs> I was a little nervous because I've never had to be like on a stage just performing for my dancers. So I was a little nerve wracking it, but then it really pumped me up when they went around the stage and they were like rooting me on. They're like, Woo! Well, we're at lunchtime on the second day, and so how much more stuff do we have to do? Well, we have a quarter of the stuff left, quite logically. Um, whether it'll fill a quarter of the time, of course, is uh, something else. Here's the vibe for this. This is the opening shot. We start on some steam, and we come down, and the track goes... Ding, 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 ding. The song is going to be used in my new movie, Next to You, which is coming out October 1st, and I want it to be in a video, so uh, they put me in it. Oh, it was great working with Brittany. She's a real pro. She's been working really hard, and I think she has to get on a plane tonight, and she's been dancing for two days straight now, and she's just been working her butt off, pretty much. What we're doing there is we're doing a bit of walking, which will bring you into the club. That's it? That's it. It's, a, it's like you're walking down the corridor, and then we're done. And then it's in the can and you're in the air. Um, yeah, just do tight and that's all I need on the guys. Brilliant. It's turning into a pumpkin in 20 minutes. Ideally, as a director, you shouldn't have any concept of time and how much time you're using because you've just got to do the best work and make sure you get any idea through. But at the same time, realistically, you have to be aware of how the clock is ticking. Sir, it's said action three times. I'll try and be louder. Whatever you've got, you, we have ten minutes to do okay. two setups. Pumpkin scene starting to form. All right, do one tighter right now. This is the final deal for Brittany. Here we go. Thomas, over to you. Action! And first! And cut! Okay, Brittany's going to turn into a pumpkin. She can go. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a wrap on Miss Brittany Spears. Thank you so much. It's pretty accurate. Two, two minutes. That's went over by two minutes. There you go. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for two fantastic days' work. It's been a pleasure. Safe journey home. Thank you and good night. Absolutely, yeah. So this is less than 24 hours since we were shooting. So the film's been to the lab and they've thrown it in the bath. 
So we transfer all this stuff to tape and then tomorrow it gets downloaded into the Avid, which is like a big computer at home. This is the this is the VH1 level right there. <laughs> right. See, and that's MTV Europe right there. And this is MTV America and then this is Dick level right there. You see? So it doesn't get that sort of proper level of videosity until it gets up to this level right there. Well, I mean, just, I mean, we had it pretty tough, but actually it's, it's pretty tough for Brittany because she got on a plane immediately after the sh shoot, flew through the night so she could spend eight hours dance rehearsing today. Anything you can put in there. <laughs> in every video, Brittany's come up with an idea of something she wanted to do. So obviously, at this point, she's thinking she wants to be doing the dance thing and a club thing. In comparison for the first one and this being the third one, there's definitely a change in the way she looks, what she's doing, the people she's being seen with. Um, you know, there's a difference. That's it. It's done. That's fine. Let's ship it. Let's see it on TV right now. Hey, MTV, I hope you enjoy my video crazy. In five, four, three, two, one, and now. The world premiere of the Britney Spears video, You Drive Me Crazy. I honestly think that this video will hopefully take me to the next level because most of my other videos, like Baby Just Established Who I Was, and sometimes was a fun summer video, and I think this video, um, the whole concept with the waitress outfits and being in a club and the young people just giving it up their all and just dancing full out, and it's going to be fun. I think it's going to be really fun. Here we go, here we go. Okay, go. Okay, go. Here we 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 go. Here we